Hello everyone, welcome back to more Octopath Traveler 2. Last time we did Cassie's Chapter 3 in the abandoned village. Which was previously known as... I don't remember the name actually. Oh well. <laughs> and that was the best, one of the best chapters in the game story-wise so far, but man. Does it... Man, is it hit. <laughs> A little strangely. This time though, we'll be doing uh, Throne Ace. Chapter 3, Mother Out, here. The next time we'll do Particio's Chapter 3. I'm assuming we're going to kill Mother in this one. Mother's garden should be around here somewhere. Many snakes are raised there, but no one knows exactly where it is. I've never been there myself. I was raised by father, not mother. Now then... It's officially an orphanage, and has the support of the local monastery. You could probably sneak in as a nun. I suppose I'll need another change of clothes. Time to find myself a habit. All right. Oh, that's what the outfits are called? A habit? I've never heard of that before. Yeah, I don't need that. Uh, there's a better dagger for Cassie, but do I need another one of these? I think I'm fine with what I have. Although a horn helmet would be pretty good for throwing a... Yeah, I think I'm fine with what I have, honestly. Okay. What about you? <laughs> just since I'm here, just a bunch of stuff. All right. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Alright. So yeah, it's been a long ass time since we've done Throne Ace Mother Out. <laughs> like, since almost the beginning of the series, it feels like at this point. My god. Uh, I was thinking of this party that we had last time. It's because we didn't actually get to fight a boss. And they're all still probably pretty low level compared to everyone else still. Oh, I forgot our freaking... Uh, reputation was destroyed. Hold on. Gotta fix that real quick. Especially be on your best behavior now. Alright. So it's like I throw any here. I'll just go see if we can steal. I'm not gonna steal that, because that's gonna be too hard. Alright, did you. I mean, I think we've already done this before when you hear the first time around. I'll take that. But you never know. But there might be something good I didn't get last time I was here. Ah. Or at least try it. 15% is not awful. Considering what other odds we've had before in the past. Oh, come on. 80%! 80%! This should be, like, guaranteed. Thank you. My god. That was very helpful. That was not worth losing my reputation that much. Right, let's go ahead and get the non-close already. A nun, working at, uh, a nun working at a convent near Walgrove. She claims there are other nuns working at an orphanage in the southern part of town. However, she does not know the details as they are not associated with her own convent. Now to put these ropes on. In the middle of broad daylight? <laughs> that child... Her footfalls. She's concealing her presence. She stole something. Impressive. She's no amateur, that's for sure. She may even be one of Mother's. It seems the slaver spoke true about the orphanage.
All right, so I guess we're following that child then. Oh, I have not seen you before. I hope you don't mind me stealing your stuff. A girl nursing her worries on the edge of the village. After losing her father at an early age, she now lives with her mother and much older stepfather. That was very helpful. Mama and Papa don't get along very well these days. But I don't understand why. Is it because Papa isn't my real Papa? But I love them both so much. Maybe if we all get together, we can figure something out. Through a child's eyes. Uh... We still here at night. I cannot... Yeah, no, I don't have anyone who can guide at all in this party. Literally is a completely guideless party, so... My thought would be just to take her to her parents. But... That was very helpful. Yeah, I don't know if that's going to be that possible. Ooh, hidden item. Awesome. I need this request. Thank God <sighs> in hell. Well, I might need her stuff for later, so I'm not going to go and lose any more. I'll just keep going forward then. Alright, Road to Mother's Garden. Already starting the dungeon right away, it looks like. Let's path to Out it. Of my way. What the heck are these things? I mean, I guess it's like a moth and then it's like larva and cat and cocoons. So, oh my god. It's kinda gross, it's not gonna lie. Axe attack. This will hurt. No. Alright, let's go for some fire. Fire. Burn. Very effective. Prepare yourself. Alright, uh do the hunter, keeping glow. Probably take this one out. It ends here. Yep, good job. Magic defense what up of all things, do. okay. Uh over. Let's go ahead and use an arrow fortune to finish it off. Fly arrow fortune. Too easy. One job point, so they're barely alive. Okay, cool. Forgive me. These things are gonna be nice and easy to kill. I'm gonna get this chest first, real quick. The Herb of Valor, okay. I'm really curious about the children. I'll do what I must. That we've been seeing in the, the mother route so far. Well, now. I really want to know if my like, theory about the weird cloning chamber crap is gonna be true or not. <laughs> Or if I'm just super out there right now with that. What? Playtime is over. Fly arrow fortune. Okay, well I finished it off, alright. <laughs> now I'm sorry. Thinking time. Uh let's go for Elements of Barrage. Indulge me for a moment. None of it, huh? Okay. My turn. Gale? Sleep. Nope. My journey will not end here. Oh, I uh, got Hikari fully, almost fully upgraded now for Hunter. By the way, so he now has Salt the Wound on. So if he breaks somebody, he gets a second chance, second chance to act again. Uh, any of this stuff I want? Not really. What's your have you just save your draw points at this point then? I mean, Ember could be good just because it's an extra fire. I already have Oswald for that. I could be better than what I have for anyone. Nope. I guess for Cassie, but she's using that for her magic though. So I'll keep her as is then. Because she still has some magic. I do want to actually have the magic to be decent at least. That's burning plum. Let the experiment begin. And kill some crabs. Well now. Please. Axe attack. <laughs> I think they're using no, the thunder. We'll find out. Strike them down. Yep. Very effective. Okay, this will probably kill over. easily again. Yeah, it's probably gonna have no health left. Fly arrow fortune. Who's next? 
Well, they have more than the other guys, at least. Mine. Uh, Divine George. Let's get him out of here. For the pride of Ku. Okay. Can I go behind this bridge? I can. Ooh, secret secrets. Heck yeah. Silent Bandana? Uh, it's better for throwing it, I guess. Technically. But not very much. Now it's low as a critical. I'll just leave him as is. Watch, we're getting to a point now. Because of how wildly, like, unbalanced the chapters are and levels to each other. Must be purged. Well, these are some freaky ass flamingos. Oh my god. The equipment we're finding in the field isn't that great anymore. We already have, especially if we're stealing my turn. from people. And getting those like rare steals off. Uh, go for a veil of darkness. Oh, wow, there's like no now damage. Your magic is absolute garbage. Holy crap. My place. Oh, I, sword. Oh, I was hoping. Poor aim. <laughs> Poor aim. My axe. I need a uh, dark is the last magic, so it could be weak to like a bunch of other magics, potentially. Uh, let's just go for a lightning bolt. Strike them down. Nope. All right. Try again. Well, <laughs> I forgot because the thing Joni has. That's but why. I hold back. Kind of forgot about that. Fly arrow fortune. Next? There we go. With the arrows. Bring two job points, all right. Expertly done, Throne. So if I just shoot you with an arrow, yeah, now. Do I get another turn right away? Here I go. Oh well, we didn't get this. Didn't, didn't happen though, so guess we won't find out yet. No. I call down the light. A week. Hmm. So I guess a week to light too. I've seen worse methods. It's easy to see how weak. So I'm assuming. I mean, you see their weak delight. Because I should definitely have their voice clips memorized at this point with how much freaking editing I had to do to get the audio back in for those four episodes that lost the audio. Alright, yeah, so there's nothing else over there. This is all what we have left now is over here. Ah, new sister, are you? That I am, sir. Go on in. There's the bell again. It has a beautiful sound. <laughs> I suppose so. <sighs> oh, this man knows what's going on, but he doesn't like it. But he's like, yeah, I guess it has a beautiful sound. It does mean we're selling off children as slaves again, but I guess the bell does sound nice. <laughs> uh, free chest. Awesome. Yeah, nothing can do to this guy at all. Okay. This must be the place. Those are mother's children. There are so many of them, yet it's deathly quiet in here. She's trained them well. My hatchlings, have you been good little girls and boys? Thanks to you, Mother's got her hands on something very precious. Now tell me, which of you brought this home? It was me, Mother. Come here, Mira. That's the girl from earlier. This is a wolf diamond. 
one of the most precious stones in the realm. I want you all to learn from Mira's example. You made Mother proud, dear. Allow her to reward you. With the mark of a true snake. Collar. Yeah. Not much for reward, really, now, is it? It suits you, Throne. How was it, seeing blood for the first time? So this happens right after a flashback we have with Father. Okay. We would do it in this order, then. I don't want it on my bread. <laughs> <laughs> With this, you're now a proud little snake. Which makes me your mother. No. Oh. My mother died after giving birth to me. I will have none of your back talk. If you want to live, you'll learn to bite your tongue and listen to me. Yes, mother. It suits you, Mira. What a pretty collar. I'll do whatever you ask, mother. What a good little girl you are. When the time comes, meet me in the Black Bell Tower. Yes, Mother. Morozov! I leave it to you to open the door. But of course, Mother. To unlock this collar, I'll need Mother's key. Yes, we've established this many times, so I... And I shall take it, along with her life. I mean, I get it. You can sometimes go a long time between chapters for an individual character, so a little bit of recap's nicer now. I enough. must find a way to get to her. But I feel like she's mm. said I need the key to my collar so many times now. Look around Mother's Garden. I can't steal from these kids. They're too smart for that. They're better thieves than Throny are. There we go. I just want to grow the thing. Oh, wow. That's all they got. There's a reference number. No, Cassie, that wasn't very helpful. That was no information. Moonfang blood. That was very helpful. What does that mean? <laughs> Jesus. That was... Reduced to a num- Oh, I can't even talk to this lady. I don't know why I thought I could. That was very helpful. Jesus. Uh, nothing in here. Did I turn off the map? I did turn off the map, but whatever. Not that big of a deal. Nothing in there. Wow, this is a big-ass empty building. With a bunch of kids. White wolf language. Thank you. Again, Thank you. don't really know what any of this means. Honestly, the, the random blurb there is as useful as not applicable. The N.A. Shadow Sage Eye. That was very helpful. No... There's that girl again. Ah! It hurts! Don't worry. I'll fix you right up. Use this. Uh, uh, a handkerchief? Thank you, sister. He made a mistake and got punished by mother. 
Whenever we fail, Mother calls us to the other side of the door. What door? The one that's always locked. Morozov only unlocks it when Mother calls us. I've been whipped more times than I can count there. You'll learn to bear any pain in time. I'm a slow learner. They called me worthless. That must be why my real mother abandoned me. <sighs> it's time. I have to go now. Bye, sister. Hmm. She was quite helpful. So mother is on the other side of the door. How convenient. And the man named Morozov holds the key. But not for long. Alright, so we just gotta steal the key from Morozov, I take it. So this organization raises children to be thieves. Why does such an atrocity go unpunished? Because of demand. A demand for those who can fulfill the wishes of others, even if it means stealing. As long as that demand exists, thieving will thrive. Children should not be made to spill blood. This must change. I wish for a world where children never, ever have to see blood. That sounds nice. If there were more people like you, I think the world would be, be a slightly better place. Okay, I sell that key. Kill that bitch. <laughs> Steal the key. Kill the bitch. Mother's trusted aid in the man who manages the orphanage. The nuns and his employee employ are all black snakes in disguise. They dress and act like sisters to convince the townspeople the orphanage is backed by the covent. Give me that key. <laughs> Alright. Let's go. again. So that's where mother is. Your complexion seems fine and you're not running a fever. You're not injured, are you? Alright, everything looks good on the outside. Now to check on your heart, take a deep breath and relax. Breathe in. Now let it out slowly. Cassie, why are you giving her a checkup now? Sorry about that. I can be a bit of a busybody. I don't mind. I was just wondering if real mothers care for their children this way. Oh, no. I never knew my real mother, so I don't know. I wish mother had been more like you, Cassie. Rone. Forget it. Let's get going. Yeah, she, Cassie has just been made into the mom of the group at this point. Between the cross paths with her and Ochet, Heirs Apothecary is calling her mother hen. And then now that scene there. Yeah, it's kind of interesting dynamic to have. This woman you probably remember just be the mom of the group. <laughs> Calming stone. I'm assuming that's just like um like status prevention. Yeah, terror. Okay. okay. This is a very quiet dungeon. I can't, I'm not sure if the music is just quiet here or there is no music. But it's just kind of ominous. And with this place being called Mother's Garden and all that, I really feel like it's adding to the more of the theory that she's like growing the children here. <laughs> Maybe not so literally as I've been putting it, but. Let's get going on here. Lion dance. Cleaning. Time is over. Fortune. Fly arrow. Fortune. Forty job points. Love to see that. Very another book with the light. Burn bright, as well as sacred flame. 
My turn. Going to battle with the axe. Uh, I'm sorry. Oh, and then now we got another one. Awesome, love it. Uh, here, good blow. It ends here. Who's next? For the pride of Ku. God, Cleaving Blow is just so good. Especially when it just heals you <laughs> at random. Oh my god, right, I think that's where we need to go. Um, this is kind of amazing here, too. You might end up missing some stuff. Yeah, I think I gotta go back, actually. I think this is definitely where I'm supposed to go. There's another chest I missed. Alright. Poison Slash is ridiculous. It almost guarantees poison every time and does decent damage, too, for what it is. It wasn't as much of a maze as I thought it was. Okay. Can you go behind this? No. Okay. So let's cut back to where I was, then. Because there's the chest I missed here. Alright, here we are. I'm assuming it's gonna be a boss here. This really feels like building up to a boss. Okay, here we are. Uh, they're definitely killing Mother. Finally, we're gonna kill one of them. I've been waiting for this for a while. Oh, goodness. Should be good now. I'm about to need more skills. I think we got enough, honestly. Alright, let's go take her out. <laughs> 